Okay, folks, so I'm going to show you guys. This is the Asus ROG Ally, um, but it is running SteamOS, um, the official SteamOS. As you can see, I can just go to, there's a uh, return to game mode. Um, but what I'm going to do is show you guys how to load or download the uh, GFN app. So what you'll the official GFN app that's now available. What you'll do is open up whatever browser you're using. I have internet, or I mean, Jesus. I have um, Edge on here. So then you'll click that. Um, you'll open up the Steam thing there. And we will just type this and go to this website, which is the uh, GeForce Now download, game on any device. What you're going to do next is is scroll down because we're not doing desktop laptop um, you're going to go to gaming handheld um, there you see your choices you have the steam deck asus rog ally the lenovo legion go the msi claw the razor edge the logitech g cloud what you're going to do is click that button here where it says steam deck you're going to click on the download and it's going to tell you are you on the current device you're going to say yes i am and hit download it is going to go up there and download it so you're going to close that out Open up your um, folder here, and then just tap that button there, and click Execute. And then you're going to click Continue, and it will install. Now, I already have it installed, so it will say more options done. So I'll go ahead and click the Reinstall, just to kind of show you. So it's going to install the app here. Um, and it, and it will, because I had it already installed and logged in, it will just go ahead and do that. So it's going to sign me out of steam because what it's doing is it's adding it to the steam library. Um, now this will not have you open up Chrome or edge or any other browser. It will not be a Nate. It will not be a web app like it was before. Like, you know, as you can see, I've got Boosteroid, I've got Amazon Luna. Those are web apps. Um, I've got Xbox Cloud Gaming web app. It's basically just the browser. This is an official app directly from uh, NVIDIA GeForce Now. Um, it is ready to go. So we're going to go ahead and return to our uh, game mode. Uh, where is it at on this icon? Uh, return to gaming mode. So it's going to boot us back into the gaming mode. I understand my screen is kind of gross. It's got fingerprints. It's got dog hair. Um, it's what I... It's You know, it is what it is. As I stated before, this is... The Asus ROG Ally has the official Steam OS. So just to show you guys, um, you can go. I'll go down here. We'll go to our settings. Um, we'll go to system. Uh, oh nope, wrong one. That's general. There we go. We'll go to system. Um, and as you can see, it says I'm on Steam uh, beta. And I'll scroll down here just to kind of give you an idea. Steam OS Hollow um, variant Steam Deck. 3.7.9 is the latest beta. Um, shows all of that. And if you go to, it shows the Steam version, client, the web, all that. Um, and it will show that this is the AC, AMD Ryzen Z1 Extreme. 5.134 gigahertz, 8 cores, 16 logical cores. 9.4 gig RAM. Shows the, the video card, the driver. 9.33 gig for VRAM. Um, so all of that is set. And just to kind of give you an idea, if you put this on the ROG, it will show that there up there is the Asus ROG Ally controller. Now, we're going to go back. We're going to go hit this button here. We're going to go to our library. Um, and we're going to go to, let's see, where is it? Non-install, non-Steam games, right there, GFN. We're going to hit the play button, and it will launch, and there you go. Now, just to showcase that this is the official app, we're going to go like this. We're going to, well, if I could get it to, okay, well, I, it's having a problem updating. I've reinstalled it numerous times. There we go. We're going to open our settings, and this will show you that, now, if this was not the official app, if this was a web app, I would be locked at 1080p 60 because I'm on Linux. But because this is the official app, now I'm able to update the, I can, um, custom set my US server. I've got the the mode is at custom, uh, custom bit rate, but you can see I am on 1440 and 120. Now I can go all the way up to 4K. I can go to uh, 1080p. So there you go.